Hello, Daniel here and welcome to another one of my um, how-to videos. So um, today we're going to be showing you how to check the memory using the built-in Windows 10 memory diagnostic tool. So if you've got um, prom problems with your programs not crashing or they're running slowly or experiencing sort of weird things, random freezes, crashes or even uh, blue screens of death, you know, that sort of thing, or you've just installed a load of memory you want to check it, then there's a built-in tool in Windows 10 to do this. now. There is something else called Memtest86, that's personally what I use, but uh, let's just show you what's built into Windows 10. So here we've got a little netbook running Windows 10, well, i say just about. So the easiest way to get to this is you can type memory, and you're looking for Windows Memory Diagnostic Tool there, or you can right click the Start menu, go Control Panel, System and Security, administrative tools and you want memory diagnostic tool so let's let's do this two options here restart now and check for problems recommended or check for problems next time let's just try it now then so obviously it's going to restart and it will load it up and uh, there'll be like a blue screen basically just let this restart on its way to doing it. And then after you've done this memory test, you'll need to, it'll, it'll say whether it's passed or not, but it'll do a basic test. And you can press F1 to get the uh, more options. So here, here is, here's the memory test. Yeah, and it's gonna run through it. If you press F1, you get different test modes. Basic, standard, ex extended, and cache, etc. Let's go with standard. And that, that'll let you start. So after this, we'll need to open, um, you, it's like a further thing you can do. You can open Event Viewer and uh, you want to check the log by, with a search term, and I'll show you that in a minute, and it'll it'll tell you whether it's passed or not. Hello and uh, welcome back. So I hope your memory test succeeded. So the next uh, portion of the video is just to double check everything did actually pass. Okay. So what you want to do is right click the start menu button, go run, and what you need to type is this event VWR. Obviously, that's an abbreviation for viewer. EXE and go OK. I've already got it um, loaded. You can go OK or press Enter. I've got it loaded up just to save time on the video because I know if you're looking this stuff up, you, you're in a hurry to do things. So the next thing you need to click on is Windows Logs System. Right click that and go Find. And you need to type in this so memory diagnostics dash results exactly like that, then go Find. And as you can see, uh, the Windows Memory Diagnostic tested the computer's memory and detected no errors. So it's passed. Um, so if you're having any issues with your PC, then check the memory first. Um, that's one of the things to check. There can be problems with hard drives as well that can cause random crashes. But if you test everything and you spot an error, obviously it'll, it gets you closer to fixing it. So I hope this video helped. Um, I want to show you I want to show you this, these things on uh, real real machines and not just screen grabs because it shows it working and as it would be on yours. If you've got any questions, uh, feel free to ask me. Thanks for watching.